Last time on Let's Play Chrono Trigger. Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster, and welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Trigger. Well, as you can see, Chrono is dead, and we've managed to somehow get ourselves captured by Dalton. But I really have no idea where we are, so I guess let's take a look around and see what we can find. Hmm, they can't try anything without weapons. Yeah, you may remember last time also, they stole all of our stuff. We have no equipment. Whoa! We're on a plane? Oh crap. We're on Dalton's airship. Oh man, what are we gonna do? Okay, now, if you don't have Ayla with you at this point, um, what you're supposed to do is, if you push A up here, you crawl up into the ceiling ducts, and you can kind of see what's going on there. You push A through the different uh, grates there, and you can kind of see what's going on down below. But fortunately, since we have Ayla, we have somebody that can actually fight. So what we want to do now is go here. Let's pretend to be sick. <laughs> the oldest trick in the book. Oh! And with no equipment, she manages to knock him out. Now that's just great. Okay, let's get out of here. Okay. Now, if you, at any time you manage to get yourself, or if you didn't have Ayla in your party, and you manage to see any one of these guys, you'd automatically get thrown back in your cell. So what you need to do is find your way around the ducks until you can find somebody's equipment so then you can fight back. But, if you have Ayla on your team, it's much easier and you can just fight back right now. Now you'll notice that she's the only one in battle because she's the only one with equipment. So essentially this is a one-on-three battle. Because it, it, the game acts as, because there's no equipment, the game acts as if Frog and Luca aren't even part of the team there. As if they don't exist. And we get a level for Ayla, very good. Hey, hey, alright, we got our money back. Sweet. Yeah, if you go to the menu screen, you'll see. See, we've got Gil again. But yeah, see, there's no equipment. See how that works? Now, the other characters have equipment, but they're not with us, technically, so you can't switch party members here. You can try to go to, try to, go to party. Yeah, you can't change party members at this point. So, that's kind of how that works. And if you go up here, you the other side of the airship. So, that's something to keep in mind. Alright. Now, also what you can do is, if you throw these switches, it changes the direction of the conveyor belt. You can go down here. Ooh, a chest. These things, by the way, are called Daltonites. Oh, Yeah, Daltonites. There you are. Got him. Very good. And we have another chest. And we get Luca's equipment back. Yeah, so now she can actually fight back. Sweet. Let me go up here. Yeah, so it leads you to another different section of the ducks. So that's kind of how the ducks work. But like I said, as long as you have Ayla with you, you'll be fine. 
Um, and that's definitely the... Oh, boy! Okay, this is the other enemy you can run into. A bite! And let's go ahead and... Uh, um, I'm going to make a ton bomb, sure. Oh! Nice shot, Luca. Very good. Now we split. Now we get the flame kick dual attack. Yeah, so now we split everything between two party members because that's what the game thinks that you have. And now you can use... Actually, we can, we can use text, though, with frogs, so that's nice. That's a good way to heal. So we'll do that. Uh, that's another way to get up into the ducks, so don't even worry about that. Again, I believe there's nothing down here. Oh, shoot. Yeah, this is just a dead end, but it's free experience. And it's really easy experience, too, so might as well use it. All we need to use, do is just use Flare. These things out. And there you are. Problems there. Woohoo! A lot of experience. And uh and tech points too, which I need because we need to get tech points going for um Ayla there. Okay, so let's go this way. Here. Oh. Now you want to be careful when you emerge from a room that you don't get that you don't get hit by uh That you don't get that you don't get into a battle with a bite. And if you do, it's not a big deal. The bites are pretty straightforward. And there we go. Job team. Very good. Alright. Looks like no choice here. Alright, no problems there. And we get frogs equipment back. Yeah, so now all three of our party members can fight. And that's excellent. And I believe this should take us up to the ducts. Yeah. So, nothing we can really do up there. Okay, let's see. Let's see what we can do now that we have Frog back on our team. Yeah, we can whoop all kinds of ass. I like it. There you go. And levels for both Frog and Halo. Very good. Alright. And I believe that's everything there, so let's just proceed to the next part of the ship. Oh boy. Actually, what I'm going to do here is... Um... Actually, you know what? We can use water, too. That would be fun. So wait to Lucas turn and get the Lucas turn and use Flare, but this will be just fine. Got him. Now, the enemies in the rooms, I don't believe, respawn... But the enemies uh, in the main parts of the ships can respawn. Now we got our inventory back. Excellent. So that means... Yeah, so we've got all of our weapons and stuff back. So that's nice. And if we need to do that, but we, st we, stu we, dil we still do need to find Ayla's equipment. Okay, and I believe this just leads us back up to the ducts. Whoa! Uh, no, go back. So that's how we're gonna get out of here. But we don't need to, but we don't want to get out of here just yet. We still have some other stuff to find. Yeah, and if you happen to run into a bite and there are any other enemies on the screen, uh, you'll immediately go into battle with whoever's left on the screen. Just know something to keep in mind. Okay, flare. Because it's only one more point than the Megaton Bomb and we'll do enough damage for sure. And there you are. And a level for Luca. Very good. And I think this is actually where you're supposed to go. Kind of, you, you make your way up through the duct area, and then just make your way over here. And that's how you're supposed to know um, how to go down. Because then you can go down here, get into the main area, work your way back down to the other part, and get your equipment back. 
There's something to keep in mind there. All right. Okay, we're still not quite done getting equipment yet. So we gotta see if we can figure out where to go to get the other equipment. There's still a little bit left we need to get. So let's go see if we can find it. Ah, here we go. And we get Ayla's equipment. Actually, you know what? I think this is what you're supposed to do. I'm sorry. Is just go through this way. Make your way up to this part of the ducks, and then you can just sneak down, grab Ayla's equipment, and fight back. So, yeah, you know, that is what you're supposed to do, is you go up and you make your way up to this duct right here. And then you work your way down, and everything is all good. Okay, I believe... There is one other thing that I wanted to show you. Now let me see if I can find it here. Uh, okay. Hang on just a second here. Okay, so there's just a couple things I want to show you before we continue out of this area. Now, if you go all the way to the right after entering that area up there, you see a little thing on the ground. And if you go down, there's a little secret area. And we get a magic capsule. But, uh, you know, Chrono's dead. So, I guess the only thing we can really do is give it to Luca, I guess. I mean, she's kind of our magic user, but... Yeah, he spent all that time building up a character, and and he dies. I mean, that kind of reminds me of Eris from Final Fantasy VII. That just totally sucks. But, what are you going to do? Okay. So what you want to do now is go down this way. We want to make our way back to the center and go all the way down. I'll show you one more thing. Huh? Who said that? Well, if you push the A button, I don't know if I mentioned this earlier, pushing A on the grates allows you to look down. Let's take a look. <gasps> Dalton! Hey! He's messing around with our time machine! Who would have known Ayla would be the voice of reason and have them be quiet? Okay. Uh oh, well, we don't like that. And now he's going to keep laughing. Just like Kefka. And everyone else is going to do a little dance. Yeah. So you're going to push the A button to get out of that. There, so. Okay. Man, Dalton's messing with our airship. we got to go get it back. Okay, so let's get out of here. Uh, oh, okay. This works. This is a good way to go down. I didn't really expect that, but that'll be just fine. Okay, now come down here. Here, is that right? Nope. Uh, oops. I guess maybe he's up here. And through here. Okay, there we go. Now we're good. And through this way. Ah, this is where we need to go. Actually, I want to heal up uh, before going any further. Let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, that's good enough. Okay. Yeah, now we're up on this area from before, which you may recall. Now, if you go up and see these little things here. Hey. Ah, crap. Yeah. You know, these are turrets. And these are kind of like those uh, those enemies that we fought earlier, those uh, rubble-type enemies. Where you kind of just got to... You just attack them and kind of hope for the best. Um, since you can't use techs on them. And these have a higher probability of running away or not allowing you to... Yeah, so they just self-destruct in there, so... These, again, these have a higher probability of not, uh, of running away. I think they kind of look like dogs. That little red thing there at the end kind of looks like a tongue. See, it kind of looks like a smiley face and a tongue. I don't know. Okay, let's try it again. Now, if you don't get any of these, don't worry about it. It's, I mean, it's, like I said, if you get them, great. If you don't, it happens. Uh, I think those are lightning elementals, by the way, which is why uh, Ayla got healed there. Maybe the Shadow Elemental. It's whatever the one that Ayla has on. I'll, ch I'll check that. There you go. Good shot, Frog. Yeah, so I think they get three laser shots off and they self-destruct. How do you miss? It's just right there. Ugh. Okay. Alright. Uh, what is that one that Ayla has on? Let's take a look. Uh, shadow. Okay, so it's Shadow Elemental that those turrets are shooting at. Okay. Nice. Yeah, you get 100 tech points, which is good. 
and Ayla learns Charm, which is a very, very, very nice ability. So what I want to do with her now is equip the, where is it? The Alluring Top, which we got earlier in the game, which boosts the success rate of Charm, which is good. Basically, Charm is like steel in this game. You can steal items. All right, a couple more turrets. Let's try taking these things out. Nope, wasn't successful with either of those two. All right, and we got another one. Sweet. And a level for Ayla and for Frog. Very nice. Okay, cool. Uh, what is? How far does Ayla have till she has her learned her next technique? Anyways, Tailspin. I loved that show. O e a, o e a, o e o, o e o. Huh? It's kind of a dead end here. Where are we supposed to go? You actually want to go to the bottom left-hand corner of the screen here. Uh oh Something cometh! Oh, man, it's another one of these things! That's... That's... And now it's time for a boss battle against the Golem Overlord. Okay. Now, we want to go all out on this thing. Um, let's try Charming. That's how charm works. Hey, oh, nothing to give but his gratitude. That's great. Okay, so what you want to do for this thing is go all out with your techs here. Um, what I would use is use flare, aerial strike, and boulder toss. And if you don't have flare, well, you should have flare at this point. Um, no, he's counting down. All right, boulder toss. And aerial strike. Go frog! Nice shot there. Uh, golem, this uh, the golem overlord has fifteen thousand HP, by the way. And man, this is even I'm just, supposed. To, looks like it's a beefed up version. I'm kind of scared with what he's gonna do with his attack. Hopefully, I can take him out quickly enough. Or maybe it's her. I don't know because the sisters were. I don't know. I, I can't tell if it's a boy golem or a girl golem? Can't tell. Uh-oh. It's counting down. I don't like this. One. Uh-oh. Uh, let's get enough, another, another flare. Okay, very good. And... Oh, yeah, we can get enough bolt shots. That's fine. There we go. Yeah, we're doing real good. This is great. Huh? What do you mean? Um, okay, I'm going to save a state here, because I want to show you something a little bit later. Uh, but in the meantime, let's just keep going all out with our attacks. Hopefully, okay, well, it didn't work the first time. We'll see if it'll work the second time here. Okay, uh, let's see. Let's be good. Okay, you know, I'm going to go ahead and save a state right now, actually. Now, I'm just going to let this battle finish. I want to show you something kind of funny here. So he's going to try counting down again. <laughs> oh, it's okay. He's all retreating. Oh, it's so cute. I'm going to pet the little golem. I wish I could pet her right now. Aw, the widow golem overlord. Oh! And he runs away! <laughs> yeah. So yeah, what we want to do is let's go ahead and uh, finish him off. Because if you if he runs away, um, you don't get any experience for it. But if you defeat it, you actually get some experience. So we want to try and take him out as quickly as possible. But yeah, I just thought I want to show that for me. This boss, for some reason, is afraid of heights, I guess, or something? I don't know. But, uh... Yeah, so just, uh... Keep, just keep looping the same thing over and over again, and you should be able to take him down without any problem. Her down with any problem. Oh! The dual techs... There you go. Got him. Uh, dual techs actually aren't as effective as single techs in this fight, which is odd, which is strange. But all right. Got him. Phew! Uh-oh. Oh, no. <gasps> Wait! Did Dalton put wings on that thing? Oh, crap! Not only has he stolen our time machine, it can now fly! Uh-oh. 
It's taken off! And now this thing's gonna lift off! How are we gonna stop Dalton now? You'll have to wait till next time to find out. Till then, this is BCS Buster signing off. Don't forget to like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter at BCS Buster LP, check out my blog, check out my donations page, and as always, take care, y'all.